Well, this is an unusual way to start a video. Frank from Frank's Garage here. Today, we're starting a series of short videos. Frank does drum heller. Um, if it's not on your bucket list, it should be. Check this out. I know Dan and his pals will be watching and you mentioned you'd like to be here. This is a side road out towards East Cooley. I had to drive up here. and I'm sure glad I did. Anyway, I'll uh, bring you back throughout the day with some 1080p time. As I was saying, we'll be taking videos in slow-mos traveling around. Uh, Slow-mo, no. Oh, Kimmy's doing a selfie. We're here visiting Kim's mom. We'll be doing some 1080p time lapse, that's it. And uh, things like the 11 bridges. Last Chance Saloon, we'll check that out Wednesday. We'll do a little town tour also on time lapse. And anything interesting, I'll bring you back and do some videos. So at this point, I'd like to thank you both for watching. Dan and crew, I hope you guys will enjoy this. Late afternoon, early evening. Headed uh, out of Drum Heller towards Calgary a little bit to the Horseshoe Canyon. So we're just going to wander over to this lookout. Yeah, it's about 10 12 minutes out of uh, Drum Heller. Beautiful spot. That's some cool rocks, eh? Dan, Linda. <laughs> I'm not bringing it back for you. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah, these are really cool. I'm gonna get a close up. What do you think? That is cool. Wouldn't that be neat? That looks like a lava formation, I guess. Oh yeah, awesome. Okay. We'll go to the lookout, do a little pan around, and uh, we'll go find some other site to see or not. I don't know. to read if you want. The rocks here are one to two million years younger than the rocks found in the Drumheller Valley. Hmm. I don't know. I figured the rocks were all the same age. Good figure. Okay.
there's the avalanche. There's the valley. Wow. This is so cool. And again, I'm going to say video doesn't do it justice. Should I zoom? Okay. Oh, there's Kimmy making her own video. Yeah. Yeah, my legs wouldn't let me walk down there, so. And uh, I'm gonna take a motorized scooter and make it back to the hill. I don't have one anyway. Okay. Yeah, this is uh, pretty cool. Yeah, so if it's not on your bucket list, but I'm going to keep saying this, it should be. Yeah. Okay, that's enough tanning. Just crazy how this is all formed. It changed, I think. We were never able to walk well, it was down there. there. And up there? Yeah, it was there. I remember that. Okay, well, Kimmy wants to do some pictures and stuff, so uh, I'm going to zoom back. Maybe you can get... There we go. Like, it's it looks huge. It's not huge compared to Drumheller, but it's pretty big. Yeah. Very cool. Okay, well bring you back when I find something else interesting.
morning, Tuesday morning. This is uh, the Oakney viewpoint outside of Swan River. We're just heading to uh, go and do the ferry crossing. And uh, this just seems like something we gotta do. This is simply amazing. Some sort of a prehistoric thing, you know. I guess it is. Look at that. Kitty got her potty break. <laughs> okay, yeah. Coffee this morning. Continental breakfast. I don't know how that is. Cold eggs. This is absolutely stunning. You would never think you'd see something like this in Canada, of all places. Look at that. Oh, I wish I had a much better camera today. Okay, Kimmy's gonna yell at me. I'm going down here a little further. Well, if I fall, we'll get a good recording of it. <laughs> okay. Um, it's a long way down. It's pretty steep. Hey, there's some nice rocks down there. Check that out. Okay. Well, it's my turn for a potty break. And then uh, somewhere down that way, there's a ferry crossing, which we're going to Show you next. Um, my editing skills suck, but I'm going to try really hard to make this decent. You know, I want to impress Dan and his coffee buddies here, so. Okay, well, back up here. Short intermission, and uh, we'll see what we can do with the. Uh, next time lapse.